Can McNair come up with some magic? It was about 20 years ago. I was working in the kitchen at Ruby Tuesdays. There was a late touchdown by Steve McNair. McNair lobs the ball for Kenny. Touchdown, Titans! And I was so excited in the kitchen. I jumped so high and I hit the ceiling, the ventilation of the kitchen. And that, that's a memory that would last for a long time. I, I cried. I cried when times lost the Super Bowl, the one yard short. Inside for Dyson. He dives for the end zone. He didn't make it. My first memory of Titans was Chris Johnson breaking a long run against the Jaguars. CJ does it one more time! 89 yards! I just loved the excitement. The house was going crazy. Everyone was going crazy. Just being in the environment of everybody just screaming and yelling for the Titans and making the touchdowns. It kind of brings me joy to see everybody bonding and laughing and, you know, watching a good game. The love of the game our community has is unbelievable. My name is Tabir Tabor. Uh, I'm from Kurdistan, which is located in northern Iraq. There's no really country called Kurdistan, but the, the land is called Kurdistan. It is uh, surrounded by four countries, Iran, Iraq, Turkey, and Syria. Kurds are the largest nation on Earth. Well over 40 million exist without state of their own. After the Gulf War in the 90s, that was the biggest wave of Kurds migrated to this country. My brother was an interpreter with the U.S. military. So in 96, when the U.S. military evacuated from uh, Kurdistan region, uh, unfortunately, Saddam Hussein's regime of that time basically said whoever helped the U.S. military basically betray the country so that they'll all be executed. So we came here as a political asylum. When we migrated to Nashville, Nashville has the largest Kurdish population in America. Nashville is known as the second Kurdistan or little Kurdistan because there are so many Kurds living here. We estimate estimate about 20,000 people that live here in Nashville, Kurdish people. And welcome everyone to Adelphia Coliseum here in Nashville, Tennessee for the first ever game of the Tennessee Titans. We had came from somewhere else, not knowing what football is. It was really entertaining and physical. Wow! McNair giving up his body. That's all we know, Steve McNair and Eddie George. For me, Eddie George and the way he was approaching the game and all his talks with Ray Lewis. Eddie's back in his face in. Football for us is just toughness. Let's go, we gotta keep fighting. Let's keep fighting. It's a team you never up right here. It's a team you never up. Kurdish people have gone through a lot. They've seen a lot. And they had to tough it out. They have to be strong enough to survive. Football is discipline. It's being smart. It's everyone working together, teamwork. It's kind of a combination of everything that a real person needs. I got your back, you got my back. Yes, Think about it like that. Always. I got your back, you got my back. Me and my teammates, we always have each other's backs. My name is Siobhan Abdullah. I go to Cambridge High School, class of 2023. I'm a second generation Kurdish American. When I was younger, my brother, he decided to sign me up. My name is Regina Abdullah. Um, I'm born and raised here in Nashville, Tennessee. My parents' generation, they came from a background that's totally different from ours. They didn't grow up with the thought of, oh, let's play sports. With our generation, second generation Kurds, um, we have more exposure to it now that we're here in America. There's nothing better to do than play football. I play quarterback. It's the funnest thing I can do. Seeing my brother play, it's like really exciting. He's playing the game, he's actually doing it. We're making history, We're making something new happen. Players like uh, Siobhan, hopefully they'll be role models for the generations after them. I'm excited to, to see uh, Molden. Molden, yeah. me too. In, in the slot. He's gonna, third round pick, they say he was still the draft. I think he's gonna be that's an insert player and have yeah. impact yeah. right away. I, I hope so. Yeah, so. 
Because the problem with Tennessee has, has always been DB for the past couple of years. Yeah. It's been deep. I'm a president of Tennessee Critters Community Council. Over the years, we've had tailgates at the Nissan Stadium. It's a way of bringing everyone together. We so, haven't tailgated in a long time with yeah. the COVID stuff exactly. that yeah. everybody, nobody had a chance to come together. Yeah. So I think it's going to be pretty cool for the yeah. first time. Everybody's coming There's a lot together. of people tomorrow. Yeah, so it, should be, be it should be fun. That's where it starts. I want to scream so bad. How's it going, brother? <laughs> good, good, good to see you, good to see you guys, good to man. See you, man. Long time. How's, how's the last 18 months been? I know, it's, it's been tough. Good to see you, good to see you yeah. again. Yeah, I know. Let's go, guys, let's go. Let's go, come on. Is it covering it a lot? We always have the American flag and the Kurdish flag flying high. Let's just say that if you are tailgating and you are next to our tent, you're a lucky group because, you know, we always offer a lot of food. Kurds are very friendly. It doesn't matter where we're at, you know. We always offer to our next-door neighbors. This is awesome. Ha it's very good. <laughs> Their food is a lot better. <laughs> yeah. We started tailgating with Tabur about three years ago. They just kind of showed up, pulled in next to us. Our first tour in Iraq, uh, one of our main interpreters was uh, from Kurdistan, was Kurdish. So it's pretty cool getting to know the guys. Man, I, I don't shoot your text. We, we get together and watch some of the games. Yeah. I, I got should. the Titans man cave upstairs. When individuals come over from different countries, there's always a sport or something in common. Sports just unify everybody. Some people like to go into the stadium and watch the game. Me personally, that's the fun of, of, of tailgating, you know, uh, staying during that game. Let's go, Ty, let's go! Just watching the game, it's a joy that you can't really explain. It's just, there's a team, like you are in it. Your spirit is in it. Lamb is the eligible receiver on the left side. Tannehill to the end zone. The outcome of the game, it, it didn't go as well you know, as planned. What happened on that play? The most important thing is we brought the community out here. It was good seeing you guys again, you know? Man, dude, it's been too you know? long. It was fun. A lot of people showed up. It was, it was fun. The game wasn't fun, but the experience yeah. was. experience was great, right? That's all that matters. Being a foreigner, when you come to a country, you always, in the back of your mind, you feel like maybe you don't belong. And that's not the case with the Kurdish community. We feel like we are home. We are one of us. We all root for the same team. 